Here the cliff notes for sun protection. There are two types, sunscreen, sunblock. Sunscreen causes a chemical reaction in your skin, detoxifies the UV rays. Sunblock reflects the UV rays. SPF stands for sun protection factor. It only tells you about your defense from the UVB rays. Since the ozone layer only sieves the UVC, UVA and UVB pass through the ozone layer and can cause skin cancer and aging. UVB leads to sunburns and skin cancer. UVA leads to sun aging and increase the risk of melanoma. So when you're choosing the sun protection, make sure that it's a broad sun protection. Nothing lasts for more than two hours unless it remains on your skin like a shirt, a hat or sunglasses. If you go into the water, you have to reapply it. The suggestion is every two to four hours to reapply the sun protection. I prefer sunblocks. Why? Because it reflects the light. It doesn't have the chemicals. Some of the chemicals have been shown to increase estrogen levels in your system. Of course, this was in the lab where they used much higher concentrations. But think about it. You are not in a vacuum. You're exposed to a lot of pollutants, a lot of carcinogens, and they too play a role on increasing the risk of hormonal changes and cancer. So choose wisely. When you're looking for size of the particle, micronize, not nanoparticles, because nanoparticles can penetrate deeper into your system. Another thing to remember is how much to apply for sunblock. For it to truly be representative of the SPF, you have to apply a nickel size for your face and neck, which is equivalent to about half a teaspoon, or one tablespoon for your arm, which is two ounces, or two tablespoons to cover your legs, which is four ounces. Don't forget to cover the ears, inside the ears, behind the ears, the lips, the brows, the hands and the nails. I've seen skin cancer in those areas. Now, you have to stay out of the sun during the peak hours. So from 10 to 2, stay out of the sun, out of direct sunlight. Don't forget, shirt, hat, sunglasses, and if you can, stay in the shade. And don't forget, you need to apply the sunscreen 15 to 30 minutes before. If you use a sunblock, it will work right away, but still I recommend to apply it before you go outside. The point is, you don't go outside naked. Don't go outside without the sunblock. Stay healthy and safe.